Beep, beep, bleep, beep. Life signs detected. Analyzing. It is Captain Gordon. Gordon's nearby? Gordon! Gordon! Where are you? <laughs> A familiar voice! Is that you, Jennifer? You must have been through hell, but have no fear, Captain Gordon is here! That's the hero? He's so cool! Lon, you got a wide strike zone. Gordon! Are you all right, Jennifer? Hmm? Who are these children? How dare you call me a child? I am the Overlord! You? The Overlord? <laughs> Quit joking around. You haven't even gone through puberty. Hey, no fair, a cowardly trick, Overlord. It's about time you came to your senses. I, Captain Gordon, Defender of Earth, shall put an end to your evil ambition of invading Earth. Please wait! Shut up, villainous! Villainous? Laharl, this rude stranger isn't a hero, nor is he defender of anything! Let's kick his sorry butt! That didn't take long. We're in agreement this time, Flan. Listen, defender of Earth! If you can defeat me, I promise not to invade your planet. But if I win, then you agree to stay here in the Netherworld and become my vassal. How about it? Fine. A hero never backs down from a fight. Gordon, listen. No need to worry, Jennifer. I eat guys like him for breakfast. Thursday and I can handle this by ourselves. All you have to do is believe in Captain Gordon, Defender of Earth, like always. Ah! <laughs> it's a deal then. Here I come, Defender of Earth. Come on, Overlord. I'll protect the Earth at any price. Thursday, back me up. Beep, beep. Blip, me, mission, acknowledged.
die. today. Heroes don't always win! <laughs> oh no! What have I done? I have injured a human! I inadvertently... Inadvertently my butt! Juan, lately you've been acting more and more like us demons, huh? N no I haven't! But if the Seraph finds out... Seraph! Seraph Lemmington, are you here? This is a serious matter. It is always a serious matter when you come here. What is it this time? Flan has killed a human in the netherworld. What? Flan killed a human? That's right. Even if she is a trainee, an angel harming a human is a grave sin. Is this forgivable? No. Such a sin cannot be forgiven. But still, that is odd. Why would a human be in the netherworld? Well, well... At any rate, I will make sure that Flan is captured. I will be using some of the troops. I have your permission, correct? Very well. I shall leave it to you, Volcanus. Yes, sir. Hmm, I never expected humans to interfere. Now then, how will he respond to this? Everything will be fine. The Seraph will understand that it was just a mistake. He surely will. You better hope so. Everyone, this is your hero, Captain Gordon. It won't be easy for Gordon. As all of you know, I am the 37th Defender of Earth. As the name suggests, it is my duty to defend the Earth. What lies ahead of... No matter what lies ahead, I swear on my honor and the name Defender of Earth that evildoers shall not escape. That is my mission! Next! Next on Captain Gordon, Defender of Earth, Episode 10, Angels, Demons, and Humans. Look forward to my adventures! Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! My ass! Shorts. Gordon, after that, clean my room. Gordon, after that, make dinner. <sighs> what?
without humiliation, the defender of Earth working for the Overlord, I can't apologize enough to my predecessors. Hmm. You look unhappy. Don't tell me that a hero would break his promise now. Oh. A hero never breaks a promise. All I can do right now is endure this. As long as my faith does not falter, hope remains. I've got it. I'll just pretend to obey him. And when he lets his guard down, I'll escape back to Earth. All right. I just need to have patience. Good thinking, Gordon. Your eyes are full of hope. You're planning something, aren't you? Uh, no, I'm not. I was just... Morning, Harley. I told you not to call me that! Why not? It's cuter that way. Etna and Flan are going to show me around the netherworld, and we're going to have a picnic. Why don't you come along, Harley? We made a great lunch. Picnic? You must be joking, Jennifer. I, the Defender of Earth, am working, and you, my assistant, are picnicking? But Gordon, today's Sunday. It's a day off for everybody. Well, that's true, but... Thursday, you'll stay here and work with me, right? Robots require rest, too. Thursday, we'll attend picnic with Jennifer. La, la, la. Hey! You traitor! There you have it, Gordon. We'll leave the chores to you. So where should we go? It's her first time in the Netherworld. So how about the Sea of Gehenna? Why? It's so hot over there. What kind of a place is it? It's a big tourist spot. Since you're new to the Netherworld, you have to go check it out. Is there a souvenir shop around? Um, it's not exactly the kind of place that sells souvenirs. Oh, if it's souvenirs you're looking for, try Sphinx's on Sacrifice Street. They've got nice mummy head feet. Oh, how adorable! Hey, that's the Nether Year 666 Limited Edition model! I want one! <laughs> Too bad. Okay. Today it's a picnic at the Sea of Gehenna, and tomorrow it's shopping on Sacrifice Street. Sounds like a plan. I'm in. Now I just plain pity you, Gordon. All right, we're going to the Sea of Gehenna. I will never, ever allow those women to go picnicking on their own. That's a great idea. We should do it. It's not like we'd be going on a picnic going, la, la, la. Someone has to protect them. Right. Let's go. <laughs> Here's my chance. I'll sneak off and escape during the picnic. Episode 10, Angels, Demons, and Humans. Prince, I'm going to the bathroom, okay?